Hi everybody, I'm Jerry Paul and I'm an indie author and this is the vlog for when we're off to darker. It is now Friday the 5th of October and we are just gathering stuff together and about to leave. So I will see you on the road. So that's our car packed and we are at the petrol station right now and just filling up the petrol obviously. And then we're going to get on the road to Peterborough and to the hotel and all of that fun stuff. So it's going to be awesome. Okay, we are like about oh, an hour, less than an hour away from Peterborough. Still lots of boxes. We've done pretty much most of the journey with wondering if we were on the right road. Let me close my window. And um, it was only when we spotted anywho that we decided that we were definitely on the right road because we remember that from last year. There is actually a place called Anywho, so that's a bonus. But yeah, and now we're just basically doing the last 45 minutes. We should get there about quarter past two, and then we can check into my hotel room or our hotel room and unpack everything, which is always a fun bit. So see you soon. So it is half past three, we are here. I'm gonna show you the hotel room in a minute. My auction hasn't turned up yet, but they said that it should be here by five, so that's awesome. And I have enough portables, so that's good. So the hotel room has a wet room, which is a big bonus because most hotel rooms, even the ones that are disabled accessible, don't have wet rooms. The one in Southport did, but this one I wasn't sure about, and it does, so that's awesome. The room is quite small, but other than that, it's brilliant. So let me show you. So there's my wheelchair. That's the connecting door. There's a cupboard there. The door is that way. And then we've got the nice TV. That's Miss D's bed. And um, got nice windows and curtains. And we've got a double bed that unfortunately me and B are gonna have to share, but that's the brakes. And there's me, hello me. Um, but yeah, I'm just set up here and B and Dala have gone to pick up some art supplies for Dala and are picking up some other bits and pieces that we forgot. And yeah, we're just basically getting ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow starts very early, about 7.30 for us. And then from there we need to be in the hall to set up by nine. So it's gonna be a bit manic, but signings usually are. And I'm comfortable in the bed, so I'm gonna go on my tablet and watch The Good Place, I think, and then um, read a bit, because that's what a holiday is for. So yeah, I will see you probably later, but most likely tomorrow. Okay, we are here at Donka. It's the first thing in the morning, everyone is setting up, and my table is mostly set up. We've got about 20 minutes until all the public arrive, so that's awesome. I'm just gonna give you a quick glimpse of the room. It's my table, and then there's like people all around. But I'm really excited and I'm looking forward to getting started and getting signing, so that's a big bonus. So yeah, basically it's going to be getting going very shortly and then I will see you soon. got like, let's see, what, three minutes to get there before the doors open. Yeah, we'll make it. It's a nice hotel. A dark hotel, but nice. It's our Scusi, please. Thank you. I think it's okay now. It's <laughs> my table. There we go. Do you want to get in Yeah, basically, they're about to start. And this is the room. Mm -hmm. 
And this is the beginning of the Dark Side of Fiction 2018. So, bonus. So, we're what, an hour into the convention now, and he's having to restock dying thoughts again because someone just brought a whole series. But it's going really, 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 really well, and there's just loads of really awesome people. And I'm going to stop now because there's someone who wants to talk to me. <laughs> so, what I was trying to say earlier before we got another sale was that it's going really, really well. Um, the hall is filled up, there's lots of people, as you can hear, there's a bit of noise, and it's just really, really good fun. Like, I'm going to show you some of the people around me. It's busy, 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 busy. I'm in this nice little corner, and we've got here, so it's just great. And in case you're wondering what B does while we're at these kind of things, here is a sneak preview of a things cover. All you're gonna see until the cover reveal. But anyway, as I was saying, it's pretty busy, there's lots of people around, and it's just a really good event and a good time and just lots of fun. Okay, Chloe has asked me to walk around and have a look at all of the stalls and get it all on camera, so that's what I'm gonna do. Bye! <laughs> It's now close to five, four even, not five. And um, the cycling is just wrapping up. Things have been really nuts and brilliant, and it's been an amazing day and a great experience. And I'm be showing you around the room, and I'm just talking to ready to get ready to pack up and go. That's my room, ready for the um, ball later. Okay, it's now five o'clock-ish, and the signing is over. I ended up having to leave. I tiny bit earlier because it was just so so hot in the hall and the air conditioning wasn't working or something or other and it was just too hot for me so I am now back in my room getting ready for the ball tonight we are having a darker of the ball and it's going to be amazing the invitations say that we need to be there at 7 30 but they also say something about carriages at midnight so I'm kind of looking forward to seeing what that is about even if I don't make it to midnight which is highly unlikely given my normal sleeping time but I've had a wonderful day I've met some brilliant new readers 
old readers, friends, old friends, new friends and I just had an amazing time and I can't wait to do this again next year basically. I had thought about not doing signings for a year but having been through this today I can't help but feel like they're just so much fun and you meet so many new readers and you meet so many new people and it's just an awesome awesome experience. So I'm looking forward to looking up to signing for signings in 2019. Try saying that three times fast. Anyway, I'm going to go and relax for a bit and then get ready for the ball and I will see you all later. Bye. Off to the ball. So we've had the meal. It was an amazing ball. There were free shots, so that's all I'm going to say because it's like 20 past 10 and I'm slightly tipsy. But it's been an amazing evening and I'm going to punch beer in a minute and just it's been just brilliant and I love going to hourglass signings and I can't wait for next year so I will speak to you all tomorrow bye hello everybody it is Sunday or October 7th so this time last year on the 7th I was going to my first signing ever which was darker and so yeah so today darker is over with and done and basically now my rest of my weekend will be spent in the hotel room and watching Doctor Who and chatting with Kim and just maybe doing some work probably not though and just really just relaxing after having spent a really busy day yesterday so yeah it's been an amazing experience I've had messages from people saying they've read the books already and they really are excited about it there was one funny one where a mum brought her daughter the first dying thoughts book and she posted a picture of her daughter when she realised that it ends on a cliffhanger. So, yeah, things went really well. I was really excited about how everything appeared and how the, the reception there was just amazing. So that's great. And I'm just, I'm looking forward to getting home and looking at to do signings in 2019. I don't know what yet. I probably will sign up to do Darker 2019. Already have, I think but I don't know whether I will or not and then I'm going to look into other signings as well because it's just a very exciting part of being an author and I love, I love them, I love them, it's just so much fun, yeah. So we're just, like I said, chilling out in the hotel room, uh, we've got Doctor Who to watch later and then tomorrow we head home so I will vlog intermittently today and then do the journey home like I did the journey here. So yeah, I will see you later. Bye. So I thought I'd do an update. It is now just after two. I've had a nap because naps are awesome and also because signings take a hell of a lot out of me. I try and build up my strength before we go. And then the day itself is just so busy and so full and so much fun that it's so worth it. And yeah, so I'm now in the hotel room. I've had a nap. Darla's here and I'm gonna sit here and read some more of my book. I have got my book work with me but I generally don't work while we're on conventions. I have the stuff in case I want to but if I don't want to it's not necessarily necessary. I can but I've booked these as days off so it doesn't matter if I don't. It also means that even being wiped out I can take the time off once we get home so that's a bonus. So yeah, the rest of the day is going to be basically reading, chatting with Kim, hanging out with B and Dala, and basically just building up energy for the trip home tomorrow, and then it should be back to work on Tuesday. So fingers crossed that all works, and um, yeah, so I will see you later. Bye. And it's now Monday the 8th, and we are just packing up to leave the hotel. That's B going to put my sell so last luggage in the car and all of that stuff so let me give you a look around the room again that's the bathroom and it's a lovely good room and we managed to have watched Doctor Who yesterday which was a lot of fun but the weekend itself was a success we had a lot of fun at darker and at the ball and all of that just general cool stuff so I'm gonna continue to take you on the way home and when I get home I will do my usual sign-off thing so yeah I will see you shortly so as you can see the car is all packed again and we are on the way home we've just stopped because we're really really thirsty and we wanted to grab a drink before we get on to the main leg of our journey so it's like quarter to 11 now 
I'll probably be home about one-ish, depending on how things go. But yeah, it's been an amazing weekend, and it's just it's just nice to be out and about and meeting older readers and new readers and just I had a brilliant time and I can't wait to do it again so whether that's for Darker 2019 or whether that's for other signings I just I can't wait I've got the post signing blues which I'm sure many people who have been to signings will agree with it happens um, so yeah we're just we're stopped getting drinks and reminiscing over an awesome weekend and a great way just spend the time really it's been really good the hotel was amazing it was really accessible um, they went above and beyond to make sure that I had everything I needed so that's a big bonus and yeah basically we're just gonna get on with the way home and go from there so I will see you before we get home bye so hi everybody we are now home it is 20 to 2 on the 8th and darker is over for another year so I am back in my office I'm gonna put all these clips together and make it into a nice long vlog to go up in November so that's all I have time for today if you want to get in touch with me you can comment or subscribe I post new videos on Thursdays you can find me all over social media and my books are available everywhere all the links for which are listed below thanks for watching and remember to keep writing bye